Hi, today we're going to be looking at the service of the fuel filter on a CAT Mini Hydraulic Excavator 3 ton through to 8 ton. Now the main service interval for this filter is 500 hours. But on a daily basis you just look at the clear glass, check to see if you've got any water in the fuel because we do have a fuel water separator at the bottom of the bowl. To let any water out you just loosen off, let the water drain out and then tighten it back up again making sure not to contaminate anything onto the ground. Also when you go to service this filter at 500 hours you put it in dry. You no longer fill the bowl with fuel because there's no longer a hand priming pump on our excavators. In the old days you poured the fuel in and then you did the hand priming. We have electric priming on our machines today. So put the filter in dry which is very important on these new tier 4 final engines because of the high pressure fuel rail and you do not want to introduce any contamination into the fuel by pre-filling the bowl with fuel that has not been filtered. Okay, once you're ready, turn the key to the ignition position, don't start the machine, and then listen for the electronic pump ticking away. You want to leave that ticking for about 45 seconds and then try starting the machine. If it doesn't start quickly, Turn the key back again just to the ignition position, let the pump run a bit longer, and then on your second attempt, the machine should fire up and then you're ready to go back to work. So that was a very quick overview of our fuel system. You can read all the details in the operation and maintenance manual. You can get information from your CAT service shop. The important thing is to remember, don't pre-fill filters any longer on tier four final machines. Just put the filter in, turn the key on, let the electronic priming pump do the work. For further information, check out other service videos on YouTube or contact your local cat dealer.